Welcome back, Mongo Fix. Well, this is a really old pencil sharpener Mongo been working on. Pulled this out of the ground at a buddy's house. And so it's been sitting in vinegar for, well, a couple weeks now, really. Just got her finished cleaned up and whatnot. Looks like there are a couple tiny holes through there. She's working good now. Vinegar worked pretty good for this, but how well it worked compared to, like, uh, the regular stuff you buy at the store. Like Evaporust. Range between 10 and 15 bucks. That's an expensive quart. Come on, go figure. Let's do a test here. Found a couple nuts that, uh, they come from the old Suburban. We want a good A to B test comparison. Same material, same size, about the same rustiness. According to the instructions here, you can't use it below 65 degrees Fahrenheit. Well, that kind of sucks. Mongo cleaned up that pencil sharpener just out here in the barn during the winter, so it only, like, maybe 38, 35 degrees Fahrenheit in the barn. So that pretty cold, and the vinegar worked just fine. So we bring it all inside. Oh, I get a... Couple little containers here. Take one of the nuts, put it in the container, one for each. Then we try our evaporust. I'd say it's super safe, non toxic, no fumes. Don't have to worry about nothing. And safer skin, they say so. We get this one in the evaporust. If you didn't know, Heinz makes the bass acid. Now we wait and see what happens. Of course, all the rust things, they always say, be sure to scrape off or remove any excess rust on the outside or something. And, of course, Mongo didn't do that because, you know, no, who, who does that? Vinegar on left. That one clear. Looked like water. And evapo-rust on right. Looked like urine. Leveling the vinegar dropped quite a bit because of the water evaporating out of it. So we'll have to top that one off just a touch. Like vinegar still still going, still reaction going on, but a whole bunch of pieces falling and broken off. And look like the evapo rust uh, need to get topped off, but that might be done. Give her just a real light wire brush. Look like there's some grease on there. They always tell you, don't use grease. Make sure to clean everything real good before you use any of this stuff. But, uh, Mongo don't have time for that. Yep, that looked like grease and crud. Look like got some more grease and crud on this one, too. Well, it's getting down to the wire. The old Vapo Rust. See, it's come out pretty darn good. Except for that spot right there, still a little bit of rust on her. So she's not quite done yet. And the vinegar. She came out pretty good, but a couple more spots of rust. So that quite not done yet either. Probably another day on the vinegar and she'll be ready. Well, since they're both not done yet, they both go back in. Now that one from the evapo rust, it only had that one spot left over, and it looked like it gone. This one from vinegar had a couple spots. But it looked like those coming off. 
Take a look at these guys. Don't look like any more rust on the vinegar. She pretty clean, pretty shiny, quartz that pitted to hell. How do you evapo rust? Looking pretty clean as well, that last piece of rust gone. If you wanted it something like original, neither of these good option. Just buy new. You know, automotive cancer, because once it starts rusting, she's just gone. The original material is not going to be the same. It's going to be impossible to get it back unless you replace it. My original question was, you know, Mongo used vinegar, mostly because it's dirt cheap. This whole gallon of vinegar only cost between five and seven bucks, whereas this 32 ounces of evapo rust hold 10 to 15 depending where you go is the evapo rust faster so you could probably say that the evapo rust was maybe 12 hours faster at removing the rust than the vinegar is that extra 12 hours worth the 10 to 15 bucks for a lower quantity to mongo no big deal just stick with the vinegar because again about the same time really see what you folk at home think leave a comment or something you know we started these absolute worst case right pulled them out of the bin they both look the same didn't clean them just threw them in if you like this video be sure to like this video if you like this video and other videos from mongo fix be sure to subscribe. Mongo is working on all sorts of junk. You know, running little experiments. See if vinegar or evaporust that much better than vinegar. Mongo, thank you.